and west when they get those things they're boomers oh yeah oh yeah very very scary actually yes. from what i've heard different from how it sounds in florida i've heard that as well mm -hmm. you know florida you get it daily in the summer but you know for us at home we could see some thunderstorms here over the next several days weather about to get pretty interesting now today we saw more sunshine some warmer temperatures still seeing clear skies out there at the six o'clock hour santa barbara sitting at a nice and warm 74 degrees we've fallen back into the 60s though around santa maria ventura lompoc and galita and a beautiful evening out there in San Inez right now at 75. But by later tonight and into tomorrow morning, you'll be back into the mid-50s. So some cool overnight temps, but that's not the big story. The big story is what's happening to our south and what's happening by the beaches. It's mostly clear out there now, but we are really keeping a close eye on this hurricane, Hurricane Norbert. We showed you that earlier in the newscast. We'll recap the details again at 630. I want to show you what's going to happen, though, closer to home. Look at 4 p.m. Saturday on Futurecast. As Norbert moves northward, we're going to get some moisture from that storm, and it's going to interact with the monsoon. So you're going to start to notice more humidity. Look at the cloud cover by Sunday. And I do think this might be a little bit overdone with how fast it's moving in, but I think it has the right idea. You can see some showers and storms' best chances. In fact, likely that we'll see some rain in the mountains, and even a slight chance by the coast. Look at 10 p.m. Sunday. You could see some rain out there right towards maybe Rincon Point, La Conchita, right along the border of Santa Barbara and Ventura County. And then again, Monday, look at the rainfall here in San Diego County, Imperial County as well, and to the south in Riverside and San Bernardino County. So rain, yeah, there's a chance of that, but the bigger impacts, it's going to be that high surf, the advisory continuing for Ventura and L.A. counties until 6 a.m. Monday. Could see sets as high as 10 feet for those exposed south-southwest facing beaches. So look ahead, that Norbert moisture is moving in. Still some fog tomorrow. We are warming temperatures up through the weekend as well, so keep that in mind if you're going to be outside. Here's Norbert right now, 100 miles per hour. Notice the green arrows. I'm trying to illustrate for you the fact that the moisture will move in the same direction that the storm is forecasted to move in. And as we mentioned, you'll feel that humidity beginning Sunday, humid Monday into Tuesday. And yeah, we could see a few ice isolated showers just about anywhere by that time. So things might get a little interesting here at home. Maybe some fireworks across our local mountains. Tomorrow, though, warm out there. Not quite humid just yet, as we'll see that fog during the morning hours, the sunshine for the afternoon. 90s back into play around the valleys, even some upper 90s. The 70s and 80s for coastal San Luis Obispo County. 80 in Ventura, 80. 3 in Camarillo, 88 in Santa Paula, and 98 tomorrow in Ojai. Look at the high tides. That's the other point of concern here. Tomorrow it's at 8.16 p.m. With the high surf and the high tides, you could see some of that coastal flooding or beach erosion in those low-lying areas. Santa Barbara watching Norbert. It'll increase the clouds. Could be a mostly cloudy day by Monday with some humidity, maybe a few sprinkles out there. Similar story in Ventura, 80s through the weekend, then upper 70s by next week. San Luis Obispo. I think the humidity and the moisture even goes as far north as San Luis Obispo County. Paso Robles also expected to see some of those high clouds, maybe a few sprinkles out there Sunday into Monday. So, yeah, things sort of changing hour by hour with Norbert. And the fact that it's now a Category 2 storm means more surf. And maybe, just maybe, a little bit of humidity, a little bit of rain showers in the forecast. Okay, some big cells off to the east of us when yeah. it comes up. Yeah, future cast look pretty good. Yeah, they do. It? Huh? Yeah.